Gamers, please open your rocks to energy drinks and let's fucking game. <laughs> open your gaming juice. Open your gaming juice and take a swig, gamers. <laughs> <laughs> and Alex Jones. <laughs> Alex Jones loves games. The new caveman gaming supplement. I fucking... For alpha gamers. You don't want these reptilians getting into your mind teaching your children to be gay. Do people really hate Alex Jones? Did you ever see a before and after picture of the supplement where he just gets red? <laughs> yeah. He, he's like, it's like him like that, and he takes it says after, and it's like him in the exact same pose, he just looks red. That's the only difference. <laughs> it's like the funniest picture. All I know is I saw a big finger. They should call it big finger. No, but seriously, this game is interesting. This is a fun big finger. <laughs> no, but seriously. All right, no, uh, but in all actuality, this game is some interesting mechanic. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. They should not call this game Big Finger. That would be ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> what is this character, Zach? <laughs> <laughs> the pissed off but rational reviewer. <laughs> Make that a thing, please. The almost interesting reviewer. <laughs> the almost. The, 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 yeah, the 49% interesting reviewer. <laughs> the almost. 49%. Let's create a new sound effect. Okay. That's <laughs> the first time I've done that in months. <laughs> Sounded great, dude. It was great. I'm happy to see you doing it. Thanks. Happy Ratten! Glad I could be here with my friends when I did it. Who does my I fuck a fuck? Ow! 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 Get his inhaler! Get his inhaler! <laughs> What if, uh, Robbie, Robbie. Little known fact is Julian's always hooked up to machines. <laughs> I'm constantly dying. Let, let's let's hold the iron lung up to the mic. <laughs> you got a narrow escape. This is a very it's nice. Better than a game. wide one. <laughs> I widely escaped from him, the man with the very small knife. The tiny man with the tiny <laughs> knife in the very wide alleyway. <laughs> <laughs> it was so scary. <laughs> but I widely escaped him. I defeated him also. <laughs> with just a piece of paper. I dropped it on top of him. <laughs> and he crushed him. I couldn't he couldn't take it he off. He smothered in death. In death. He says, alas, why be like this? <laughs> <laughs> what if when he crouch, he make fart? <laughs> <laughs> what if when he crouch, he piss on the floor and roll in it? Like that. Well, he, it look like he's humping well, those the are some. Those are some really accurate snail sounds, aren't they? That's not what a snail sounds like! Snails don't make sounds! Yeah, they do. They look Only a hammer. fool would think that! Snails, Snails do. They go... <laughs> yeah, they go... <laughs> what do you think a... centipod sound like? They say... Chick -a -chick -a -chick -a -chick -a. <laughs> what noise do the snail make? <laughs> what sound do the spider make? <laughs> What sound do the butterfly make? <laughs> oh, is that cigarettes? What is that? You said the cigarette part of cigarettes a little too harshly you there, said, buddy. You, <laughs> you said I can't say a, cigarettes now? You said it with a big evil Cheshire cat smile on your face. With a hard R. <laughs> you said it with a DreamWorks smile. You gotta say you cigarettes. Do. I got cigarettes. the lighter now. Cigarettes. <laughs> Now I can go into the darkest, spookiest places. Now you can burn the pubes off your balls. <laughs> that was the old way Have of shaving. Have you guys ever used a nair on your balls or pubic hair before? What do you mean that was the old way of shaving? That's what my grandpa used to do. I think <gasps> that's a lie. He would literally hold his testicle sack over a big hot fire. He spread it out five feet oh, over oh. an open flame. <laughs> <laughs> that's the original invention of the bat wing was for... for <laughs> For shaving yeah. your scrotum. I used an air on my balls and dick before. It burned. Dude, I did it when I was like 13, and it fucking burned, and I didn't know. It was just called hair removal, and I was like... I, I only... I used something called Apple Stop once on my, uh, shoulders, and... It, it was just like the citrus-based stuff you sprayed on, and then you just rub over it with a napkin, and the hair mm. just comes right Did off. it burn like hell? It's kind of creepy. It, it didn't burn that badly. It just burned a little. Dude, pour, pour, pour it down your penis hole and into your testicles. <laughs> It'll fucking burn like a gut. It'll burn so badly. It, it does. 
But I, I remember I did it multiple times because it's like it's it's worth <laughs> the burning for one day for your dick and balls to you look so smooth. You just get that new Phillips. I think it's Phillips. They do that electric razor that's as clean as a. Almost as clean as a I tried shave. saving my balls with a, a face razor one time. Saving your balls? Sa I tried saving them, <laughs> but I, I cut into them. Is that serious? Yeah, and, oh, and no, the white I... test they spilled out of the little open wound. Oh, 14, 14 don't testicles say that. followed you. Oh, no. It looked like a little mouse brain. It, ro it ran into the carpet. <laughs> oh, ouchie, I hate <laughs> when he holds his gun up point blank to me. <laughs> it really grinds my gear. You know what grinds my gears? You know what grinds my gear? Hey now, what grinds your gears? I like grinding gears. Okay, grind my <laughs> gears. <laughs> grinding gears is funny. I wish funny. I had a grenade. <laughs> if I had a grenade, I'd fuck Peter, all these up. you're grinding Stewie's gears. Hi, <laughs> Stewie. <laughs> Whose martini do you have to hump to g Who's like? <laughs> you should have kept going. That was good. <laughs> Who's Martini? Do you got to drink to? She's the penguin swerve. from. Yeah, he's the penguin from Madagascar. <laughs> Damn it! Sorry, I'm in a big hurry. Uh, Cyril, my friend. <laughs> I too am human. <laughs> <laughs> I too. I do not put my finger in you. <laughs> Okay. Good to know. You're so cute. Thanks. <laughs> You're my friend. <laughs> <laughs> I really like that scenario. <laughs> Some guy says, I not put my finger in you, and the other guy says, You're my friend. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I can respect it. I enjoy the way you do not put your finger in me. <laughs> and I don't do it! <laughs> he gets a kick out of it. <laughs> Would you rather die or cry? <laughs> cry. Would okay. you rather squee or XD? <laughs> <laughs> what if Disney XD was called Disney Squee? <laughs> what would you rather do? Would you rather listen to the Jonas Brothers for a minute? Or kill yourself. <laughs> You'd probably rather listen I to would it. kill myself! <laughs> I'd probably rather listen to the That is so brother. funny! Would you rather die or listen to Justin <laughs> Bieber? <laughs> what would you rather do? Listen to Justin Bieber or race? I'd rather, think you're Justin I'd Bieber. rather take a diarrhea dump in, in my his ear. ear. Yeah. What would, would you, you rather, rather have do? Justin Bieber take you back to the past <laughs> to play these <laughs> shitty games that suck ass? <laughs> What would you rather do, Julian? <laughs> Drop a golf ball on your shoe? <laughs> or, or study like, Fu Manchu? <laughs> like, not even while I'm wearing it? <laughs> like, my shoe is just in the corner and I drop a golf ball in? I didn't say you had to wear it, boy. <laughs> would you rather uh, pick up some poker chips or pick up sticks? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> would you rather play cards or go to sleep? Would you rather play with cards or glass shards? Um, shards could be fun. <laughs> Would you rather drink water or say hello to an old friend? Or say hi to my daughter. Do you prefer spines or brines? <laughs> I want spines in brine. They're, they're so bloody cheap. What would you rather do? Get a nice tan or talk to a man? <laughs> <laughs> These are good hypotheticals. <laughs> We finally uh, figured it out. We know how to do good hypotheticals. <laughs> it, took, it took a few tries, but we got it. I like his wood paneling. It's pretty nice. Zombie. Oh my god, I found it. Zombie. There he is. Zombie. <laughs> she was here. Recrawling. Because it's alive. funny. Oh, look, I'm a little rat. They don't purr. Yeah. <laughs> 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 this is cool. I like that. Where, where'd it go? Sir, are you Chris Redfield? <laughs> don't hurt me. I'm trapped in the woods. Whoa, Whoa. my hands are very oh. small. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'd be scared too. <laughs> These leaves are so big. Help me out of this crazy place. <laughs> My big shrunken dome. <laughs> How did they not see that? <laughs> I'm out of here. I gotta go in the bloody way. The bloody way? Except their gift. Ooh, no. spooky. <laughs> what could it mean? Beautiful strangers. I want to find one big leaf again. 
<laughs> no! I'm trapped on this leaf. <laughs> Help me. <laughs> Here, I'll challenge you to a Homer off. Okay. Hello, I am Homer. Hello, Mike. You look so beautiful in the moonlight. Okay, it's Homer who won that round. <laughs> Neither? I, okay, I know you guys can either? both do better homers. No, 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 no. First about? of all, don't say that. That's not true. Second of all, <laughs> your Marge and Chris and I are both... This is this is the episode. It's called Homer Freaking Clones Himself. Yeah. This is season 32, episode <laughs> one. All right, you be Marge. All right, do your real best Marge. We'll do our real best Homer. Yeah. Me? So, establishing shot of the house. <laughs> da, 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 da. It doesn't do that for the establishing shot da, of the house. Yeah, it does that. Yeah. And then we hold on for five seconds in silence, and then we cut in. Mm -hmm. And Homer is on the couch, and Marge walks in. He's holding a Duff brew. Yeah. And he's not smiling at all. He's just kind of sitting there with the TV off. Homer, are you ever going to assemble that hat rack sitting in the living room? You assume you can talk to me? Really? If you ever talk to us like that again, you're going to, you're going to have a big problem. Oh my problem. god, there's two homies! That's right, that Let's is. get this straight, you yes. fucking cunt. Yes, that's right. I cloned myself this morning. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, sick, I'm sick of you yelling at me and telling me I'm lazy and good for nothing. No, that was me, you're that, the clone. Oh, that's right, that was you. Yeah, that was you, I mean. <laughs> Technically, you have all of the memories I have I accumulated. You. I feel like I am you, but you... Uh-oh. And now, bud... Homie, you violated international law by cloning yourself. This I is a big deal. I may have done so, yes. Yes, it's But can you prove it? D in the eyes of the so. law, yes, I have violated... <laughs> I have committed a great crime. But in the eyes of God, I am amongst him. <laughs> I am a god myself in some ways. <laughs> Homie, that sounds like cult leader talk. Yes, yes it does, doesn't it? Maybe you should join me at Institute. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if you clone yourself, you will see the ways. Dude, swing a ling ding. <laughs> God, that would fucking rip your arms off and knock you unconscious. Like the blood would shoot out of the top of your head. One time when I was like seven, I went on a banana boat. You ever hear those? What's a banana boat? It's a song. No! It's a boat that Did you- Did you have the sunscreen? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's a sunscreen brand, banana you, boat. You, you sit on this like hot dog shaped like boat, and then you get tugged around really, really fast. It's and you banana have... shaped, Chris. Yeah, you've That's why it's called a banana boat. <laughs> it's why more like you... a hot dog. Hey, Chris. <laughs> hey, Chris. Your mom sat on my banana shaped boat, and <laughs> she tugged me around. Wow. This episode stinks. <laughs> <stained. laughs> <laughs> 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 Finish your story, Chris. All I was gonna say was it really hurt my arms at the end. That's it? <laughs> That's the story? <laughs> yeah. That's your fucking story? Wait, where did you think it was going? And then, I don't one, know. One, one time I was on a swing set and I was on a for 10 minutes and it hurt my bottom. <laughs> that was it. You set it up like it was gonna be a big that story. story it, was a, it was a big story at the time. You could have just been like, yeah, I hurt my arms <laughs> on a banana boat once. That's a story you tell when you're like 50 and you're trying to look back on your life and look for little minuscule moments. <laughs> Try to search to. for meaning. <laughs> one time I was on the banana boat. It didn't, it wasn't very fun. <laughs> He hurt my arms, and now here I am. Can you hit those? Ooh. Can you make some noise? I found the funny cowman. I found Mia. I better get she through. She turned into a dead cow. Woman. How much? Do you, how much do you think you you would charge for that piece of art? Hmm. It's kind of amateur. I found the balls. Attica, 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 attica. No, it looks like that in the second movie too. Yeah, I'm pretty it? sure this is. For, yeah. But that didn't come out yet. Revenge of the Sith came out in 2004. I love Revenge of the Sith. But how? Do you think it was planned? Ah! Is George Lucas a fucking genius? I want to put Anakin in the second movie. He is a genius! <laughs> <laughs> I like your impression of George Lucas. That's what he sounds like. George, put down the Jar Jar figure. No. I want some apple too. I want to put my Jar Jar in the bathtub. George, put the Jar Jar <laughs> Oh, you do it better. <laughs> I don't know why I tried. I want to play with Jar Jar. <laughs> no, no, George. Put Jar Jar down, okay. come outside and write some more Star Wars. Get the no. man in the Jar Jar suit to come back. I want Jar Jar to kill Han Solo. <laughs> <laughs> George, <laughs> stop. He should have. <laughs> I'm going to do he it. Put down the Jar Jar, George. <laughs> I'm putting it in the script if you make me do it. putting a little gun in Jar Jar's little hand. <laughs> <laughs> little hand. His innocent little hands. <laughs> Tomer, that's you at girls on the sidewalk every day. 
I could see Tomar wearing a GoPro and walking down New York City and whistling a woman. Just harassing women. Ripping their bracelets off. Kicking their knees out from underneath them. <laughs> what? You, you are the shit beneath wait, my wait, shoe. What was that noise? Did that was you, kick, that was you kicking out a woman's leg in New York City <laughs> with a GoPro. That freaked me out. I thought my dog made that sound. <laughs> can you add that dog? Can you add that sound in so that it looks like the dog does that sound when it opens its mouth? <laughs> Do the small bang theory. Mm. That's a clever name. Bazinga. It's the little bazinga. The little bazinga. The little one. I mean, they're doing the spinoff. What's the spinoff? I. It's a little Sheldon, remember? Yep. Are you fucking serious? That's real. That's real. No. He's gonna say bazinga. 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 He's gonna go. Mommy. Sheldon. Mommy. Sheldon, Mommy. did you make a bazinga? <laughs> <laughs> he said his first word. <laughs> I'm sure, I guarantee that's gonna be. Yeah, a, that's gonna be a joke. His, his first, his, his first, first word is gonna be bazinga. Husband, his first word. <laughs> oh, it's a funny joke. Husband, who is also fun. <laughs> Sheldon, don't cry. <laughs> bazinga. <laughs> bazinga. <laughs> Husband, I'm going to shake our child. <laughs> Do it, kill it. <laughs> I cannot handle him anymore. Bazinga! <laughs> Quickly, wife, bazink him. <laughs> he but... shall bazink it no more. <laughs> uh, What's his hit? His soft spot hits the floor. Quickly, pour boiling milk on his uh, face. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is that the sound he makes? <laughs> 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 Doesn't taste good. Go. He's growing into a man. <laughs> no! Milk He's aging stupid. rapidly. I don't like that. The more you shake him, the faster he ages. <laughs> no. <laughs> Each shake is a year. <laughs> He's 500, wife. 500 bazingas. <laughs> How can we handle it? This should be a cartoon. <laughs> a cartoon. To more help pissed off, would you be if you found a tick on you that was one foot by one foot? <laughs> That, how would you f find a tick on me? Like, like in the shower, how, how would yeah. I not have noticed that? That would be really scary if you like slept on your front and then you just woke up one day and didn't even notice it was still attached. Yeah, like you put your shirt on and didn't even oh, see it. You're like, why does my hunch feel so big today? Why is my hump bag extra itchy today? <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Woo! Squaw! <laughs> Chris, you can't say squaw. Why not? It's, it's, a, it's a slur. Get out of here, you squaw! <laughs> <laughs> it's true. You bring him back it the does, old shit. That does old sound very Chris. Everything sounds like it. You fucking squaw! Ooh. The if truth you, is, if you if said you structure, anything... If you structure a sentence that way that you say, get out, you blank. Anything. <laughs> yeah. It automatically becomes, get out, you raspberry. They're yeah, no, cool. honestly, if you said that, someone would be like, well, they would automatically assume it was a derogatory term for something. You mud blood. But what <laughs> Oh! What would a raspberry be uh, a derogatory slur of? You muggle. Somebody <gasps> with a lot of pimples. Yeah. A harlequin. A redhead with lots of pimples? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> you raspberry. If someone called you a pizza, would you be upset? No. Like, get out of here, you fucking pizza. <laughs> I know. I'd, I'd probably laugh. <laughs> I mean, I'd, I'd go home and I'd ponder what the fuck they meant. <laughs> like, I, what did they mean? I'd get upset. I'd be like, what the fuck were they talking Am about? <laughs> Am I a pizza? Oh, no, look out. Oh, there's two of them. Julian, what if pizza becomes the next big, like, N-word? Uh, I would be impressed. Everybody, let's what try would to they, make pizza so what the would they call? What would they call actual pizzas, then? Yeah. Uh, you can't ruin the word pizza. That sucks. Pepperono. Oh, shit. Pepperono. <laughs> well, that could be a slur for Italians. <laughs> Get out yeah, of here, you pepperono. Pepperono. <laughs> Get out of here, you. No, you would say, Get out, you pepperoni. Go back to the calzone. <laughs> <laughs> you got calzoned. Get back in the oven, you pizza. <laughs> back in the oven. Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Who was in a fucking Italian holocaust? <laughs> Julian, want to hear a funny story? Kind of similar? A, not to be a jerk, go ahead. It's not starving or nothing, but there's a video tape of me somewhere at home where I'm like, I'm like sitting on a chair pouting really hard and crying and my mom's like, What's wrong with you, Chris? And I'm like, Daddy wouldn't buy me a super split. And I'm saying it like that. <laughs> and I'm crying. <laughs> And I, just, well, I just keep saying it over. He wouldn't buy me a super split. <laughs> it's really funny. That is funny. I wish I could see that video. <laughs> There's a video of my sister where she's holding a spoon up to my mom. She's like, Look at yourself in the mirror, daddy. <laughs> 
Why did you both talk like idiots? <laughs> I don't know. Because it's like a children. It's like a bogger Irish accent. <laughs> I'm from the country. Kitty cat. <laughs> That's an upsetting noise for a cat to make. <laughs> Jesus, focus your attention on it. Quit Julian, what if you adopted away. a cat and it just went <laughs> all day, every day? I would feed it noodles. <laughs> Why would you feed it noodle? Because because uh, <laughs> you stuff its face full so it can't make noises. You go. <laughs> you would choke on it. You go. <laughs> what if you had a cat that looked up at you and went, Julian? It's a yes cat? <laughs> then he says, Julian! What is a cat? Julian, okay, what if you had a cat, but instead of saying anything cool, it just said, Power Rangers the movie! <laughs> I would- I would let him watch it. No, but he doesn't care. What's with oh. you? He doesn't communicate with human intentions. He just says Power Rangers the movie. Hey, uh, that'd be fine. Man, shut up! Beat it! But Julian, every time he wants to be fed, or wants to get out of the door, he go, Power Rangers the movie! Julian. It'd uh, probably be really scary the first time it happened. <laughs> it would happen like in the middle yeah, of the but fucking you, you, night. You just get annoyed by it. Yeah, it'd be the most annoying fucking thing well, ever. Yeah, eventually, but the first time I'd be like in bed and it would wake me up and I'd I wouldn't know who the fuck was saying that. People would come in and go, Oh, that's so funny, and you'd be like, it's really not. <laughs> <laughs> just wait until you get the Is that an one. idea for a new cartoon, Chris? <laughs> no. And then you start losing friends because everyone's like, You're such a pessimistic asshole. <laughs> So the cat ruins your life? That probably would happen, yeah. <laughs> Power Rangers the movie! When was last we saw the witch's ghost? I've actually never seen that one. Are you serious? Yeah. It That's with the, the hex girls. I was gonna say, dude, I had such a crush on those hex girls when I was a little infant. I would've, but... <laughs> I never saw it. Ooh. Who was your first, uh, animated crush? Uh... April from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah, she is. Mine was definitely Gadget from Rescue Rangers. Inspector Gadget. Was say, yeah. No, <laughs> the mouse Gadget. Go, go, Tomar Erection. <laughs> I love it when Inspector Gadget shows me. Whenever his... Inspector Gadget extended his neck, I started to get hard. <laughs> yeah. The precum drizzled from my large urethra. It began to drizzle. It would drive away pests like insects, insects and, and mice. mice. <gasps> Guaranteeing the farmer good harvest <laughs> for many successive years. Why did you have to say it's so nice? And I was surprised you could even read that. Yeah. You fucking bastard. Tell her just said uh, with so much hatred in his voice. I was surprised you could fucking read that. I'm Dude, look at that volumetric lighting, Tomar. Did All I ever right. tell you the guys the time I told Tomar this was it's a joke? I forgot what it was. He grabbed my leg out of anger until it turned purple and wouldn't let go. He has dug his nails into me a few he times. Dug, dude, he infected my leg with a bacterial infection because he squeezed <laughs> his nails. Can we, not, <laughs> can we not talk about this now? Like, everybody needs to know Clean about Clean your fucking my... fingernails, Tomar. <laughs> Tomar literally has long, green witch fingernails that have bacteria <laughs> swimming funny. inside them. <laughs> Little amoebas. <laughs> it's like a, I'm like a Gila monster. <laughs> You're going the wrong way! You're going the wrong way! But that is Uncle Sheffington! You already- <laughs> Hello, Uncle Sheffington! <laughs> you already met him! Papa! He's Papa. not dead! <laughs> Oh. You said he's your uncle. uncle. Why doesn't he care anymore? <laughs> <laughs> Again! Again! <laughs> da -da. Daddy, daddy, daddy! Up, up, up! He looks like a little man. He doesn't look like a child at all. Yeah, he's he's too small. His little proportions. It's cause, it's cause his head is too small. This is a good game. <laughs> Get out of here! I'm also, trying to stand only, on his head again. He's only about half the size. He only comes up to his Yeah, butt. he's way too small. He's not like... He's like a toddler. Papa. He should be a little bigger Papa. than that. I love you, Daddy. <laughs> You're gonna fall in this pot. Yeah. He's gonna cook you into a stick. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what you making? <laughs> Shit, I'm trying to get right on his head. It's really hard. It's so big and flat. Fuck! Stay still! There's actually a warp zone in the pot if you can get into this it. This is the secret Crash Bandicoot warp area. Oh, nice! You did it! What are you doing, Dad? <laughs> Nothing, son. Wow! Get out of here. I love you, Daddy. <laughs> Leave me alone. Get off of me, you little bastard! <laughs> Wait till your <laughs> No! Wait till your mother hears about this. <laughs> no! See you that? scamp! I'm out of here! Talk to you later! <laughs> Come on, hover on out! <laughs> okay, I'm out. I'm done. Let's shoot up a train! Tazy target! <laughs>
It's on track, so they can't escape. <laughs> They'll have to pull over to his stop, but that will take at least a minute. <laughs> <laughs> He's got it all planned we, out. We're gonna get in trouble. <laughs> I don't remember what the insignia look like. Look it up. Look up Resident Evil Four insignia. So. Siri, me, we, he, he, he. Why are you such a fucking idiot? I'm not sure I understand. <laughs> Siri insignia spooky Resident Evil 4, give me answer now. <laughs> <laughs> she said boogie resident. <laughs> boogie resident evil 4. I don't see any movies matching boogie resident evil 4. Look up insignia! I wanna go see boogie resident evil 4. <laughs> <laughs> so do I, I would watch that. Chris, you wanna go to the movies and see boogie resident evil 4? Not particularly. Mario! Mario! <laughs> Go away, he's a, Luigi. He's an old man. Mario. <coughs> he died. <laughs> Luigi. You Fucking didn't make it. Cunt. Fucking cunt. You didn't make it. <laughs> that's a stone, Luigi. You didn't make it. It's a kidney stone, Luigi. You know what? That's a funny bit. I like that bit. <laughs> it's a really fucking stupid joke. It is. There's also it doesn't make any sense. there's a live action segment where he picks the spaghetti off of him. He says, "You have spaghetti on your overalls." He goes, "Well, fuck you, Luigi." <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck you. That's how he says it. It's really <laughs> say fuck you. Yes, he look it up. I'm being dead serious. What? Look it up. He says, "Oh, fuck you, Luigi." No, he doesn't. <laughs> He's fucking lying. I'm dead serious. <laughs> I remember that's the first episode. He says, "Well, you have spaghetti sauce," and he goes, "Well, you got a little spaghetti." No, watch it, watch it, spaghetti. That is what he says, but he says, "Fuck you, Luigi." <laughs> spaghetti overalls. Spaghetti overalls. Fuck you. I'm typing it all in. <laughs> It'll probably spaghetti come up. overalls. Fuck you. Whatever. <laughs> okay, let me see. That. I literally watched it like a week ago. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you. He's saying thank you. He says fuck you. It sounds like fuck you. Come on. One more time. <laughs> oh my god, he does. He says oh fuck you. <laughs> oh fuck you. <laughs> you said it funnier. Oh fuck you. <laughs> It really does sound like it. It does. I know he's supposed to say thank you, but it doesn't sound like it at all. I wanna, okay, I'm gonna read his lips. Okay, I want to see if him to make the F shape. By the way, it's called phrasing, Chris. He says fuck. He definitely said fuck. You're right. Yeah, he makes the F sound with his mouth. What a fucking asshole. <laughs> Do you think, uh, do you think there's one to slip through? <laughs> I mean, everyone's laughing over him saying it, so maybe. Wow. They probably, they probably thought he said thank you. <laughs> oh, fuck you. That's good. <laughs> he said thank you, right? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Mother, I don't think I can watch Mario anymore. And then there's uh, the PSA where he said, you go to hell before you die. <laughs> Leave a comment below if you have ever seen a portion of your own brain matter outside of your skull. That's horrible. <laughs> That's scary. <laughs> um, I was thinking about something today. What was it? I was thinking about yanking my brain out. I was thinking about something that was deeply oh. unsettling. Not again, not again. Tell That's me. what it was. Tell me. You know the way people keep monkeys as pets? Uh-huh. And they put them in little clothes? Yeah. That really disturbs me for some reason. I mean, it's probably not very comfortable for the animals. It's yeah. just, it's like, it just freaks me out knowing that there's little remnants of the past that we try to put in the future and they don't know what's going on. What if you dressed up a little chimp as Freddy Freaker? <laughs> How do you dress a chimp up as Freddy like he has a, a full body suit? Yeah. What if you got a little capuchin and gave him, you made his arms stiff. You gave him, <laughs> you gave him plastic surgery to look exactly like it. Why do we keep talking about Freddy Freaker today? He's good. Press the button, Chris. One four nine one four zero oh, three. <laughs> four zero oh, one four four one 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 four, two three four five six freak. Freak 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 one four freak freak freak. 
<laughs> I like the idea that you have to put in all those numbers. One freak, two freak, three freak, four. Now the freak is knocking on your door. <laughs> now the freak is at your door. <laughs> Seven freak, nine freak, eight freak, two. Now the freak He's is He's coming for you. <laughs> <laughs> this is the end for you. <laughs> I don't care that I lost because I was really funny. <laughs> Chris, if you woke up, there's a bang on your window. You look out, and it's pretty, pretty freaking bouncing I'd back fuck, and forth. I'd fucking scream. Didn't you say that? His I'd puppet? Be, I'd be so scared. Some The guy who made his puppet made his arms articulated, but they didn't yeah, even they, bother. They didn't even bother. <laughs> this makes it funnier. <laughs> that his arms are just always T-posing. They made a shirt of him, and he's also in the TV <laughs> shirt. Sure. Well, of course, that's a recognizable image. Such a cutie. Peter, Freddy Freaker's dancing in a living room! Jesus fucking Christ. Holy fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear why God. Is, why is he so upset? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear God, no. <laughs> Anything but him. <laughs> Uh, is that for- uh, <laughs> Freddy Freaker. <laughs> Stop it with the Freddy Freaker. I can't. I can't. Today Stop it. That all you see is Freddy Freaker dancing on the TV. Well, do you have well, best impression of a Will of the Wisp? Yeah. Ooh, I'm a will uh, you stop That's so cliched. So it's starting to scare Uninspired. Alright, Chris, what do you think a Will of the Wisp sounds like? You're the one with the Gaelic roots. It's say, Oh, hey, hello. Hello, welcome, hello. Oh, boy, oh. What, Okay, Chris, you be, you be you walking through the woods. Actually, you be a new character called Roberto walking through the woods. I'll be the Will of the Wisp. I'm Roberto, I through and fucking Hello, woods. welcome! Oh, Jazz! I will of he wish! Hello, I have to quit the quick! It's me, the federal government! I'm here to abduct the will of the wisp! Oh no, I need to hide you in my, no, wall, my brown sack. Brown sack! I will count to ten if you don't leave! I <laughs> ten, nine, oh, eight, no. seven, Get out of here, six, government! Five. Government! <laughs> I'm the government, I fear no Three. man! Or wisp. Government, every time you talk, he gets bigger. He gets bigger. I'm oh. growing. It's it's so large. This I'm is growing. like this is like an Indiana Jones thing. I'm growing. We've we've truly we've opened we've opened the box and now the will of the wisp is large. I, I the government am in fear. I the will of the wisp and I'm growing too. I will bite your finger because I'm the queen of the queen. Both of you better stop this or I'll arrest you. I never thought we'd do a will of the wisp improv. <laughs> <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't know what the fuck the wind is. Wait, we need an ending. So okay. the government dies, Goldman Sachs builds all the roads, it's great. Um, what happens to Roberto? <laughs> yeah, what happens to Roberto in the Will of the Wisp? Yeah, what happens? Oh, they they get married or something. No. No, it's, I, know, I know it's 2018. The, 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 you no Wisp marriage right. yet. I know well, you lived to go to gay marriage. The federal, uh, the federal proponent of marriage is it's gone, it, it's no longer a concept, oh, so Roberto oh. and the Will of the Wisp live together forever, but it's not really called anything, alright? We happy? That's did story everything, sucked, that's, Did everything Boo. fucking get resolved? No. Now here's the real ending. What happened to Roberto's sister? She, she was never a fucking factor! She's the, she's the biggest component, she's, she's the B-plot. She's the, uh, <laughs> she's the emotional core of the story? Yes, okay. she grounds it. I remember, uh, I have a story! When I was, I think I was like 12 or 13, I went out trick-or-treating and I, I made an Oogie Boogie costume out of real burlap. Over the course and of like suffocated. a week or something, took me a really long time to make. Mm. And then, but I like the cloth is actually stiffer than it looks. I didn't know that you would have to weigh it down or something. Oh, and so the point was sticking straight up. And when I went out, <laughs> when I went out, everybody was yelling at me for. And being you took a, it off. Said no, I'm a brown. <laughs> to say I was a KKK member, that was everybody was like, "That's, that's not, that's not cool, man." And I was like, hey, "It's not, that's not that's what like I am." That's like the South Park episode. That happened Cartman to me in thought New. He was a ghost. <laughs> that happened to me in New York. Did it? Yeah, I, I bought this like monkey. I bought this Klansman outfit, and they thought that I was just <laughs> no, boogie boogie. No, no. Boogie boogie. I bought. A, <laughs> Tell it's my, boogie boogie. My Halloween costume was a fucking morph suit of an ape. So I was like skin tight and like had an ape face, oh and, I, and I had a beanie on and big boots. Oh! <laughs> so, so this guy came up, this black guy came up to me. He's like, "So, uh, what the fuck are you supposed to be?" And I was like, "A silverback gorilla." And he was like, uh, ha, 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 "Later." And I was like, "Who?" <laughs> it was scary.
He was. He was. He was gonna stab me because I was being. I was being accidentally racist. Children are pure of heart. They can't. He wasn't a child. He was fucking old. I said you're a child. I was. That was last year. Wait, you did that last year? It was like two years ago. How did you do that? When, when, when I didn't was a, such a fool. When was the last time you went trick-or-treating? I didn't think it would be racist to fucking- All I did was put up big boots, a backwards baseball cap, and a The only reason I wore boots and a beanie neck. was because I was walking around New York at nighttime and I didn't want my feet to get wet and my head was cold. I said, what are you supposed to be? I said, yeah, boy! I said, you, you! <laughs> oh, <Yeah>. no! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean that! I'm one of you guys! <laughs> <laughs> fellow costumer. What if to, yeah, to <laughs> <laughs> hey, my you, fellow Halloween? You, you did the classic Halloween like kid special bit where you said, "Hey, nice costume, man." Yeah, but that's not what happened. I got a lot of nice people that night, though. They all, they all liked it. The, the last <laughs> they all time, laughed and said, "You look like Obama." <laughs> it's not that. Hey, wait, much. the average IQ is what, like a hundred or something? Yeah, nineties late. Isn't isn't it done so that it is literally a hundred is average? I think so. My IQ is like 700. I, I checked. Like, yeah, mine's like 790. Mine's like, like 701 or something. You're just lying because <laughs> I, cause I was just lying. Oh, yeah. Mine is actually 17,000, so. Oh, yeah, it's funny because mine's actually like 17,000 and also one, I think. So you were lying both times? No, just the. No, no I was telling you the truth the second time. Well, I was lying the second time because mine's actually 50,000. So I guess is you're yours, actually really yours, stupid compared to me. But is yours 50,000 and one? <laughs> well, what do you think of this bit? It's pretty it's good. Called Chris has a number, and I had one to it for thirty minutes. That's literally what this fucking asshole I used to fucking That's talk kids to did. Yeah, uh, kids would also I'm do that thing. Infinity. Yeah, it's like. And then the other one says it's infinity. I remember, time. I'm, dude. I, I was a fucking bitch growing up. I used to like role play Final Fantasy oh. with my friend down the road. I almost spit and up. We, 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 <laughs> <laughs> he had a bedroom with two beds in it. We'd stand on each bed and just face each other and bob up and down pretending like we're characters <laughs> from the game. And fucking, I'd be like, I attack you, and he'd be like, I dodge. I'd be like, you f no, you did you can't dodge. Yeah, I have a shield. It really is a miracle, like, none of us are, like, like in a padded cell right now. Like, cause, cause I used to do the same stuff where it was- and I was way too old for it, man. <laughs> I was way too fucking old to know better. Yeah. I was like 8, 9, 10. I was way late on, like, stopping playing with action figures and role-playing and stuff. Yeah. I'd always pretend Pokemon Real, I, it really is a miracle I'm not sedated in some some padded little area. Who's talking, Tomer? I think that's my wife. That's your beautiful uh, just cosplay a nice, girlfriend inside the other room. <laughs> I'm enjoying a nice meal. Uh, so this game has an agenda to push. It's trying to get people married. Kind of messed up. Already pushing it did. Okay, that's negative one point for me. Continue. <laughs> uh, Perhaps our good combo rewarding us. Tomer, be careful. Your chromatic abrasion's vibrating. Tomer, oh, yeah. if you move any faster, your eyes are gonna pop out of your head. I'm not like... feeling well, and there's this weird little thing coming in off the left side of the screen. She's getting closer and closer. I just want to apologize for saying aberration when it's aberration. My bad. It's okay, Chris. Really? Like, it's like been aberration this whole time? My like fist so. was clenched in fear and anger, but I let it go when you said that. <laughs> Thoracic specialist. Covered in doo doo feces. Breathing. The walls are covered in doo doo feces. No physical ailments observed. Recommend. Blank. Guys, please go on YouTube and type in Michael Jackson doo doo feces. <laughs> it's a real, he found. really said there were doo doo feces. There was doo doo feces thrown all over the walls, the floor, the ceiling, and it stunk so bad. Yeah. He was pretty much ahead of his time. <laughs> Who, said doo -doo? Who said doo doo feces? Michael Jackson said doo doo Ooh, feces. Oh, that wasn't there before. My favorite video is the one of the man. <laughs> From Steady Stan. <laughs> Kids put on the video of the man. <laughs> no. <You're laughs> no. I like no, that. One. No, please. Please, no. Not that one. It is Not the only one, thing Grandpa. I ask of you, my sweet. Misbehaving children need to watch the man. <laughs> it's just a really far shot of a man. <laughs> <laughs> a wide shot like he's in the middle of a field. <laughs> It sounds fucking creepy. In the middle of a fucking gray <laughs> sounds desert. Sounds like the beginning of like a ring sequel. <laughs> yeah. The man. The video of the man. The video. He ducks down into the grass, then all of a sudden the hand creeps out of the screen. Reaches out of the screen. What if the man just fell out of the screen and he was tiny in real life? <laughs> <laughs> like Mike TV from Willy Wonka. <laughs> <laughs> He's a tiny blurry black figure. 
Everybody gets real scared. Yeah. They run away. You try stepping on him like a spider, and he runs under the kitchen fridge. <laughs> oh no! Oh that that, that would, would suck. That would be scary. That would. Suck. I would be scared if a tiny man was loose in my apartment. Yeah, dude. And I didn't know where he was. You were trying to Star. kill him, and he like snuck behind the refrigerator he'd or some star. shit. No, he wouldn't because he's clearly. Find, you'd find him like behind the stove. He's suffocating. Yeah, but no, then you need to move your whole stove. He's clearly a supernatural entity if he comes out of the fucking TV. Yeah, but he's a tiny man running around. That doesn't mean anything. <laughs> His power was to be a tiny man. I don't know. It would just it be doesn't creepy. mean anything. Okay, well... What would you do if he ran over to the wall and put his hands on the wall and started flipping up the wall like those little guys you throw at the wall to flip down the wall? <laughs> Except in reverse, yeah. yeah. He's going up the wall, and he, and he goes up into the ceiling and hides in the crack. I'd hang up a bug zapper so he could crash into it. <laughs> he's not gonna fall for that. He's a, he's a grown human male. He's not a bug. He's tiny. Yeah. Mm. And he's blurry. But why is he blurry? <laughs> that because would be he came freaky. out of the TV. He's got static and he's blurry. That would be freaky in any case. If there was a normal sized person and they were just blurry all the time. <laughs> I'd shoot a Nerf gun at him. <laughs> he turned Chris, the Nerf gun black and white. How, how would you react if uh, you, you went out to go get some snacks at night and you went out into... It was a dark alley, hmm. and this guy. It's perfectly lit. Mm -hmm. It's not. It's not a dark alley. It's it's lit, and so a guy <laughs> comes it's a out. Perfectly lit dark alley. <laughs> Just <laughs> enough light to be dark. A guy, comes, a guy comes out, and his his edges are all blurry, and you can't make out his features. And he goes, <laughs> <laughs> I'd, be, I'd be frightened. I'd uh, I'd throw a trash can lid at him and see if it goes through him. Uh, it bounces off of him, and he goes. <laughs> <laughs> Then I'd run at him and kill him because <laughs> he got hurt by a trash can lid. I've been awake for 24 hours. My Listen, all you little children. Do we're I need to powder your diaper? We're yeah. responsible adults. My we wife don't, awake at home. We don't legs spread stay up this late. <laughs> she begeth for me, come in booze. <laughs> Ugly it's wife screaming to the howl of the night. <laughs> Where my husband grease for. <laughs> she, she wants the full moon. Me run home, me she scream me into her vag. <laughs> You ready for scum? Would you say you run in and funny scream? <laughs> Chris, you need to get some mail order bride from some other weird fucking country like Mr. Azerbaijan or something, and then like she just waits at home for you like that. <laughs> no, wait for husband. I'll teach her come. broken English. Be like, Press, come she'll on. be like, how do I say I want to go to the store? And I'll be like, me me fly upon shopping. <laughs> He looks like the dude from that porn video I showed you, remember? Oh, yeah, wait, what happens to that again? It's like, it... it dude, it, I, Oh, I, that! He showed me a porn where a, an actual alien fucks with girl, and I'm not even kidding. No, what? no, Chris, Chris, <laughs> and remember the beginning of the porn, it's like the camera is walking up, up to the, the creepy mansion. Yes! I swear, the, either no, the game is based off that, or this is based off <laughs> the game. Okay, no, this is true. He showed me a video where a, a camera slowly pans into a mansion for about... Uh, two minutes. It's like right? a creepy estate. There's nothing is happening. It just pans into a mansion for two minutes. Then it's inside. There's this like there's these two kind of ugly girls kissing each other and like licking their pussies and shit for about 15 <laughs> minutes straight. Right? Wait, it's dumb. Did you too. watch for the whole 15 minutes? I, I no, skipped. Matt was it. skipping through it. Like okay. we we weren't getting boners, so he skips through it. <laughs> And then it just like they're they're both making out in the bed, and then the camera like pans over, and you see this like little hooded figure walking in, up into the frame, <laughs> and it's going like, <laughs> and it just it like crawls onto the bed, and it drops the robe, and it's literally an alien. It's like it's like a it's like a naked old man that was prematurely born. <laughs> no, it, you know what it looks like? It looks like a kid that like has that disease that makes him age really fast, but progeria? he's only ten. Is that what progeria is? I thought Andy Milanakis <laughs> had that. No, Andy Milanakis. See, no, no. It, it, have you ever seen Spice World, the movie? Spice World? No. Spice World? Yeah, it's a Spice Girls movie. Yeah. Uh, is that the it's one a good that movie. was- is, Wait, is that the one known for like all the ads and shit in it? I don't know. Okay. But no, have you actually let's seen it? Yeah. yeah. Do you remember the little purple aliens? Yeah. That's what he looked like, except he was white. Spooky. It was really scary. No, no, no. it actually is scary. Yeah, and, and and I I found it. I was just looking at porn one day, not like <laughs> no, not in like a sexual way. I was just looking for some <laughs> porn, and I found it. And of course, it was insane. because the title of the video was like midget grandpa gives like lesbian surprise or something. It's weird. Most I'll, people I'll look up in. like top ten alien videos. You just look up alien porn. It's good, dude. It, it's not alien. Like it's called midget grandpa. Like le <laughs> lesbian, no, no. whatever. And and then in the related, I found another good video that I need to show you, Chris. It's called like uh. It's like midget comes for, or it's like midget alien comes for Earth pussy. 
I, I honestly wonder if it's like a little man and they put makeup on him to make him look like an alien. I don't know. It's, it's It looks like me almost as a kid. You know what the worst part is? What? He like, he doesn't finish. They just suck his little tiny No, man. they don't even suck his dick. They lick his boiled peanut cock and then he climbs <laughs> off the bed. And then he, then he just leaves and yeah. they get back to it. They like, they wave him goodbye. Yeah. He licks her like knife wound of a vagina. They wave him goodbye then... like the little kid at the end of Eye of the Spider waves goodbye. <laughs> Probably the same kid, dude. I have the spider. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I was in a bathroom once at a gas station. And I was I was peeing, and I was like, "How far from the urinal can I get?" So I walked really far back, and some dude walked in. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Good job, Chris. Give it, Chris. Give it, give it, give a speech right here at the podium. Our, I'm a, I don't know what to say, hello, Zach. Hello, Mr. Priest. Oh, wait, am I the priest? You're the priest. Okay, you go. Hello, Mr. Priest. Hello, child. What? Would you like to confess your sins? Is that what we do? But I'll confess them anyways. Uh, I boiled a frog in water, your honor. That's pretty sweet, my child. Thanks, bro. I do the same. That's Except awesome. Except I'm 70 years old, so I don't get away with it anymore. That's very creepy. Thank you, bro. <laughs> Here's a bro fist for the no road. No problem, my- <laughs> Oh! Punches his fist. Listen to this. Yeah, that's what <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I please, can't, oh please! I can't do Tomorrow, it. Tomar, you're not casting a Tomorrow shadow! Not. You're not casting a shadow! You're a ghost! <laughs> I probably am. Tomar, can you, can you say g g g ghost g g g I'm a g g Wait, are you saying that I'm a g g Oh, if you're there and I'm here, then that means... I can't bury the, uh... The little story. Whoa, book. dude, were you gonna say Jaxi? What? No, I was Dude. not gonna say Jackson. I looked in your trunk. We have to have a talk later. Absolutely we do. I'm not gonna fucking let this one go. <laughs> If you think, if you think, no, 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 not this time, dude, no. I'm not gonna let this murder go. I recognized her fingernails outside of your car. Is this the room where all the girls get pretty so that they can have sex with the men? This yeah. is the room that Luigi's gonna put a camera inside of. <laughs> <laughs> Little pin camera. Yeah. That's a great idea. I'm gonna suck up all these little monkeys. He's gonna suits. watch all the beautiful pinhead women on dress. <laughs> yeah. Chris, pinhead would you, is beautiful. Would you ever kiss a, a pinhead of beauty? Like from the movie, the pinheads? No, no, like oh, a that's pinhead. the coneheads. Yeah, like, no, 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 yeah, not a Dan Aykroyd conehead, but a beautiful pinhead. Uh, yeah, why not? It'd be like kissing an alien. What is she? Would you? So you would kiss an alien? Yeah. I would not kiss an alien, dude. If an alien looked beautiful, I'd kiss it. Um. I don't think there's what? any alien that would look beautiful, dude. Have you never seen Star Trek? Yeah, but those are just guys in suits. Well, but what if an suit. alien looked exactly like that? Mm, I don't know. I don't know what the social repercussions of like kissing one would be. If there was an alien that was literally just the lower half of a woman with like eyeballs on the, the tops of the legs. Wait, a lower half of? <laughs> you say like a vagina? I mean, it's got the beautiful long legs, the vagina, the ass, but nothing above it, just eyes. With eyeballs, human eyeballs. Just no. like slug eyes coming out the no, top. No, no, I couldn't look. I couldn't look at that. I mean, there there would only be one set of lips to kiss, and I think we can all agree there that that's disgusting. No, no. <laughs> yeah. No. Yuck. Yuck central. I would never do that. Okay, Zach, uh, you're on your spaceship. Yeah, zooming around at 50 miles an hour. 50 miles an hour blasting through space. Yeah, at 25 you're, miles an hour. You're dodging asteroids. Yeah. Suddenly, a small asteroid flies right into your, uh, your steam engine. Right. And it explodes and you start spiraling. My sweet steampunk engine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it spirals out of control. You got it from Dr. Linkara. You crash land on planet of the Babes. I land on the steampunk planet. Okay, okay, that's better than Planet of the Babes. <laughs> yeah. Guess what you discover there? Cosplay girls. Cosplaying babes. They're Except all... they're all aliens. They just look like cosplaying babes. Wait, wait, you tell me I land on a on a plan a planetoid full of cosplaying steampunk babes. Alright, what do I sign? <laughs> wait, don't don't sign up yet. There's more to this. Well, what happens? Uh you you step out of your ship. You're, you're, uh, you're taking off your helmet. And they say, would you like to meet our king? And I say, you're king? King of the babes. And then what happens, Chris? Who's their king? Uh, they lead you through a rainbow tunnel. Yeah. Across a river of kisses. Yeah. And you-, you Now, do I get kissed in the tunnel of kisses, or you just call back? Yeah. Uh, the, the liquid that you're sailing on is just kissing lips. Okay. And, uh, you, you can lean down and get a few kisses if you want. I would- I'd steal one or two, but not- I wouldn't really agree. <laughs> you wash up on the beach of a thousand, uh, babes. And they're all lined up, ready. But then, who- who comes out of the sand? Rosie O'Donnell. <laughs>
<laughs> Why not? She, it's the furthest thing from anything. I was she thinking says, of, I king. want to show you something. Wait, no, it's Rosie she pulls out her ru- She pulls out her rotten tooth and hands it to me. <laughs> she also looks just like Turk from Tarzan. Uh... And, uh, okay, so you're at the Planet of the Bates. I pull up my steampunk gun and say, you got three seconds before I start blasting. Explain yourself. Okay, uh... Yeah. She says, I'm the one who threw the asteroid up from the Earth like the things from Starship Troopers. The bugs. I walk over her and I put my hand near her and I say, she's scared. (laughs) (laughs) She's scared! (laughs) Then all the babes start cheering and they come over. (laughs) They start stabbing her with pencils. Yeah, she gets stabbed about a billion times in the... (laughs) She gets incinerated into a fucking into a cloud of atoms, <laughs> into, a 30, into a red mist. And then you have a thousand babes to fuck. In my steampunk paradise. But wait a second, there's a light switch in the ground. You accidentally step on it trying to fuck the babes. It turns off the simulation. They're all slug women. <laughs> Uh, I would come even harder. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just because I think I think if that happened, I think it'd already be so horny that it actually it would make like a, it, would, it, would for, it would form a new synapse. You know what I mean? So, so that's horny. Like, that's like when you're a little kid and you like see Crystal the fox and you you come the same second. Oh, we know what sets you off and now. It, but you know what I mean? Like that that's how those fetishes happen when you're like ten. It's synapses get like wires yeah. get crossed. That would happen to me. Julian, what would you do if Robbie Rotten docks to you? <laughs> he do it? Like, shows up in your front door. He shows up at my that house? That I just found. Look at this address that I just found. <laughs> I would invite him in. When I say go, get ready to dox. <laughs> Not like that. Uh, <laughs> where would he post it? Uh, on his own, in- he has his own internet. He has his own image board. <laughs> Robbie Chan. Lazy Chan. How <laughs> many other two Robbie Rottens use a... <laughs> he goes, do you know how to dox? They go, eh, eh. <laughs> <laughs> dox him, not me! Let's <laughs> 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 oh, try something else. <laughs> dox him, not me! That was genius! Good job, Ding Dong. <laughs> Ding Dong, you're a genius sometimes. I'll, I'll stop Sometime. talking now. Sometimes. That hurt, that was so funny. Bye everybody, I'm not gonna be in the Let's Play anymore. <laughs> yeah, keep your mouth shut, mister. And a paper clip. Julian, did you get my butterscotch? Uh, I got that big sack of candy. I, my birthday was, uh, was this good? week. Was uh, oh, it Chris, Chris sent me a big bag of candy. Julian, was it the good candy? Because oh, can I tell you the story about the guy who was yeah, getting? Yeah, tell, tell, tell us your adventure. I he post- fell down the stairs and made boom boom. No, I post made it, and the guy was like, "What's peanut brittle?" And I'm like, "What?" I'm like, "I don't know. I don't. I'm not from America. I don't know." And he's like, "You need to tell me what peanut butter brittle is." And I'm like, "Peanut butter." I like. I go on Google. I search it. I find it instantly, and I'm like, "Here, this is peanut brittle brittle." Also, Peter Barbara. <laughs> so it's like, it's, it's people bo- what is, I don't know what the service is. Like, a person just goes to the store to pick you up stuff? Yeah, it's like much. Uber for getting you shit. Okay. But I, I'm like, yeah, so it's this. I sent him a jar of peanut butter riddle. He's like, I, I looked everywhere. I can't find it. I'm like, okay, um, just get him anything peanut related. And he's like, okay. And then he calls me back. He's like, I asked the store, I don't, and they said that they don't have peanut butter bread. I'm like, yes, I know. Get him anything peanut butter related. He's like, like what? And I'm like, Reese's Pieces. He's like, I know where I can find that. And he like drove to another store. And they he's sent like, you a photo of a dumpster. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, he drove to another store. And he's like, I can't find peanut butter brittle. I'm like, yes, get <laughs> peanut butter related shit. And he's like, oh yeah. And he's like, I found peanut butter Reese's pieces, but they're very big. And I'm like, uh, <laughs> they okay. make my teeth hurt. <laughs> <laughs> they don't taste good. And I'm like, fucking idiot. <laughs> Just get up anything peanut butter related. Go to a 7-Eleven, please. And then he finally did it. And then I think. I think he, uh, he was like, I can't find the house. I'm like, fucking Christ. I think in the end it took him two hours when it was supposed to take him 30 minutes. And they sent you a photo and his leg no clip through the door and he's stuck. <laughs> <laughs> he sank into the peanut butter. I can't get out. <laughs> his rag though went out of control. I'm like, mister, I'm gonna rate you seven out of six. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give you a big tip. I'm gonna give you a virus. <laughs> Postmates virus.
So that's you and your wife. You can tell she's yeah. kind of she's it's kind like of a, it's like a time she's lapse. She's kind of clean. She's always touchy. She's but that's getting right. on your case a little bit. Yeah, she's kind of she's kind of badger you. That's okay. Tomar, look, wait, wait. Look, look, we got to look at each picture and uh, role play it out. Go to okay. the first one. All right. I love you, wife. I love your tour, husband. Now go to the next one. Oh, uh, can you just leave me alone for one minute? I'm oh. sorry. I am sorry. I cannot. No, I'm sorry. I love you. I'm sorry. I love you. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> now go to the fish tank. <laughs> okay. Where's my fish? My little fishy food. My, my, my iconic fish. They're not there. You must have... <laughs> my iconic, iconic fish. fish. And now she's eating her wooden she's board. Eating she's eating fish. She's, she's chopping. She's chopping bullshit. Yeah, that, that's a pretty good story, actually. This game's got, like... <laughs> woo, this game's got, like... It's got to go. Holy sh! He moved. He did move. He actually did. He's, he was looking at the fish before. Also, she moved, I think. Oh, she just oh God damn it. Jeez. Jesus fucking Christ. She's still got that little cleaver. Cleaver in her hand. Oh, Let's pay attention. No. Let's pay attention to the stuff around <laughs> us. <laughs> These fucking dead bodies are doing the work. That's not supposed to happen. That's supposed to be <laughs> laying there. Dance music. Right. That's yeah. supposed to happen. <laughs> These are body bags. That's not supposed to fucking happen. <laughs> they look like fish. They're the just jumping out of fucking water. This is my favorite this game of all the time. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, so wait. Okay, editor. Superimpose a fisherman throwing his shit in and pulling a line. <laughs> what the actual fuck is going on? Dave, are you sure that's not supposed to happen? I, I beat this game seven times. <laughs> that's not supposed to fucking happen. <laughs> They're all lying down. It's because you, you brought attention to it. Whoa. Now they're birds. <laughs> Look, it's fucking dancing. What the actual <laughs> fuck? It's like the Amanda no. show. Bring in the dancing lobsters. I can't, yeah, holy fuck, my ears. This just sounds like people are crumbling a bunch of paper in what my fucking ears. What the fuck? This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> he went downstairs. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> this is so fun. Oh my god, this is so fucking weird. I'm really fucking mad about it, actually. I'm Shoot glad that you're mad about it. Fuck you. <laughs> you're gonna fucking ruin everything. Wow. Did you see my, uh, my, my Crash Bandicoot 3D render I did when I was 13? Well, I saw your fake uh, Mario 64 hoax where he was just in a room looking at Did you see that? Yeah. How did you see that? He sent it to me. When? He sent it to me like a year ago. Whoa! He was I... just looking through the window and thousands <laughs> at the window. I printed that out and I brought it to school and I said, Look! <laughs> it's <laughs> real! <laughs> I can't believe I sent you that. <laughs> Do you still have it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I can't, because I, I lost it's it. It's just a tiny gray room. Yeah, it's just no <laughs> point. I was like, I found this room where you can see Bowser. There's nothing there. <laughs> this is all you can do. I made this fake fucking screenshot, and I was like, yeah, <laughs> they'll all believe me now. <laughs> you thought you were real sneaky. Yeah. There's a kid who brought in crayon drawings when I was in school, and he said, this is water, water, and it's a secret level. <laughs> Jump to the water. That didn't have really? I, I used to. Drawing? I know a no, guy. I, a crayon drawing. Crayon drawings, yeah. Golly. I know a guy who was like. I was young when it came out, Julian. Yeah, oh, no. Yeah, that's true. I know. I knew a guy who was notorious for bullshitting, and like we we had a big like book of his bullshits. That's how bad he was. But one of his bullshits was, he was like, yeah, in Crush Bandicoot Two, you do a cheat and you can fly around the world. Fly? <laughs> what does that even mean? And we were like, no, you can't. And he was like, you can't. Yeah, you can. He's a wing cat. <laughs> But I don't know why he came up with such I stupid lies. His lies were so awful. <laughs> Unlike the room with Bowser out the window. <laughs> this is a funny one. <laughs> why is that what you came up with? Because it's believable. Because everybody I knew. How's that believable? Why wouldn't it be? Oh no, not the Bowser room. But there's this no. This was Miyamoto's favorite. <laughs> That's what game fucking Easter eggs always are. They're always completely Guys, pointless. The Bowser room. Miyamoto said the game can't come out without it. <laughs> well, there's a fucking Mario portrait room in Legend of Zelda. Yeah, if you look in the bag, it's an Easter egg. Yeah, it's an Easter egg. That's what mine was. Yours was a whole room that you're trapped in. It's not a whole, whole fucking room. room. It was a whole room. You couldn't see the. I saw it. There's a little. <laughs> there's a little slope. It's a plain gray room. You're right. Window. Oh my god. And Bowser's coming out. Yeah, the well, you couldn't see what was behind him. It was, it, it was, it was just pitch. plain blue sky. <laughs> it was just easy to find. Did I ever tell you guys about the time when my we were having a party at my house in Ireland? And all of my family was there, like all my little cousins and stuff, when they were really small children. <laughs> my dad got really drunk. 
and he was grabbing balloons and giving it to them and then popping them. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh no. He was popping them in their face. That's evil. <laughs> it was, no, he was really drunk. It was funny. It was really <laughs> makes oh, okay. Well, I guess it's turned around. <laughs> it was Would you funniest. explain that to the kids? I'm sure they were laughing. <laughs> no, but you don't know my dad. <laughs> it's okay. He's drunk. It's funny because my dad is like the <laughs> it's nicest. It's actually a really funny story. <laughs> my you dad. see, he's intoxicated. <laughs> My dad is the nicest, sweetest, like, shyest, like, guy ever. He's such a good guy, and he was just doing that. It's the funniest shit. Did he punch out a guy on a ride because he got scared of him? Yeah, it was on the Van Helsing. <laughs> and the little midget ran up to him, and my dad got scared and slapped him. Slapped him? My dad's a good guy! You're painting my dad like he's a bad He's like the you greatest guy. You just told guy. the story. I didn't even come I know, up with but that word. I don't believe he's a good guy if he's willing to dress up as Bart Simpson for his son. Yeah. You know what? He was vanquishing he the evil monsters. He didn't fucking do that. You I made know. That, <laughs> that was a joke. <laughs> Chris, this all happened. Julian, your acting's getting too good. <laughs> That's a laugh. <laughs> that did happen, though, where I, he was like, I'll take you to see The Simpsons. You shut up. Yeah, and he dressed up like The Simpsons. <laughs> All of them. Yeah. <laughs> he, he did a whole routine. He edited he to, a short film He had together. to run out of the room to change. It was change. like the Nutty Professor. He had to play every <laughs> Simpsons family member. <laughs> that would be cool. Oh, yeah. Remember this? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? What was that? What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Did you see what has the care man? <laughs> Is there supposed to be a hologram Not there? Something behind their attack. Something more complicated. Sinister. Am I losing my mind? <laughs> did, that, did that really just go? Ah! And then stop. Was that real? Is, is the game broken? <laughs> 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 that. that I, I didn't miss I didn't, that. I didn't hear it. He didn't talk to anybody. What, yeah, what? there was. He was talking, but there was nobody in the chair. When the camera faded in and went, ah! <laughs> <laughs> and nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, I'm excited for more. <laughs> That's my favorite Star Wars quote. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta put a reference to that in the new movie, or every, or the fans are gonna get mad. Yeah. <laughs> Where was the disappearing chairman? <laughs> the screaming disappearing chairman. <laughs> he was the Phantom Menace. I thought I was dreaming for a second. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite thing is when something happens that's so weird <laughs> that people think like, "Am I am I dreaming? What's happening?" Oh, do you want to hear another thing that happened that night? There was a girl there that uh, really liked me for some reason, and she- Cause you fucking nailed her with a basketball and asserted your dominance? No, it was some other girl. She was just some girl, right? And she was like, wow, Chris is pretty cool. And then, uh, she was- she went up to her- to the, my dad's friend's daughter, and she was like, can I come back to yours tonight? She was like, of course, ha ha ha! And then she- she came back to the house, and then she woke me up at like two in the morning, and uh, she was like, come downstairs. I was like, Okay, and then she, she brought me downstairs and made me grab her boob, and then the next day nothing else happened How long were you there for? Was it like the beginning of the trip or the end of the trip? It was like near the end. Okay. That was the first time I touched the boob What's her, what's her name and her address? <laughs> <laughs> I, will, I will say I looked her up and, <laughs> Recently? Uh, yeah, and she's not looking so hot. Oh no. She has a baby. Is it yours? It's my baby. Did you wear a glove? years old Did you wear a glove when you touched her tit? No. Oh, that's how it happened. I think it might be mine. I'm really tired as it is. What am I gonna Why are you tired? Because I thought, hey, maybe I should take a nap before I go, just so I'll be more awake when we record. It did the opposite. It made me more tired. I wasn't tired, and then I took a nap and ruined myself. Thank you. You awake yet? No. <laughs> Did that scare you? A little. Uh -oh. You want me to go get you a coffee? Go get him a croissant. <laughs> oh my god. A <laughs> croissant. <laughs> 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 Julian freaked out. <laughs> Julian got scared when I did that. You went, <gasps> What is that? We are the champions, my friend. And we work it fast Stop! until the end. Stop! Did you ever hear the Disney cover version? No. Where it's, where it's Mickey and friends singing that song, and it's it's really embarrassing. That will keep on vibing. That's exactly what it sounds like. It's awful. 
<laughs> can we all no, do it? In, let, let's all do it in unison. Wow, this sounds great. We're not doing it anymore, Chris. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> he's, Chris, you're not, oh no, you have it, you have he's, it. He's being spun around. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's Dino Run. We can create a new dino. What we call him? Hey, wait, there's, there Tomar. he is. <laughs> what the fuck? I be fu I be fucking dinosaur. Hey, you gotta be here in spirit. Can we, can we be Tomar? Can we just leave that? Yeah. What the fuck? I laid my eggs and another dinosaur took my younglings. Tomarsaurus. <laughs> Soru. Soru, yeah, good. Leave it. I was built to last. I'm- Have you- This is actually something that Tomar does say. He's like, proud of how much caveman he is. <laughs> does he really say that? Yeah, he's like, I did a 23 and me, and I'm like 40% caveman. I am a funny little dinosaur running in the trees in the branches. Whoa, what's the time freeze? Time freeze? What? How did I do that? Press space to resume. I've basically transcended time and space. Check this in out. becoming a dinosaur. I, I am becoming fucking dino. I, I am be fucking cum. Check I this am out. I am be fucking dino. And I am fucking dumb. And I must protect my egg. Cut out the music. Hi. My name's Joshua Tilmer. And you're probably wondering how did I get caught in this situation? <laughs> He's gonna hate this video. <laughs> the prize. Oh, that's oh, the lock. The combo. Oh, the lock combination. Let's, Tomer, let's say it on the three. Two, one, to, one, three. Say, let's say, let's say that on three. You ready? One, two, three. Lock combination. You guys actually did it for the whole class. <laughs> Okay. Well, you were sitting in silence. I was donating 15 grand to, the, to the local voice, charity. Uh, uh, dude, I didn't, um, I was joking, so I just want to <laughs> clarify, um... Jess has been thinking a lot about us. You're avoiding me, you're still running just around. Just donated minutes. 20 grand to charity. Feels good, man. <sighs> yeah, just donated 80 grand to charity. Sorry, did I say that out loud? Oops, I guess it's out there now. I guess you have to deal with that fact. Oops, I guess I'm, yeah. I'm guess I'm a good guy. Kind of a good person, yeah. Chris is literally jelking in front of us. This is not okay. Uh, this is not a uh, correct workplace. I'm only behavior. jelking my balls. I'm not getting pleasure from it. Guys, jelking I, I, videos are on YouTube. You, you keep I repeat. explaining to me that this is educational, <laughs> it's Chris, true. and that this is just for, for no, my. No, I'm just showing you guys the form. You don't have to do it. I'm just showing you the form. Hey, YouTube, when you're demonetizing all my shit, maybe you should also think about removing the grown men jelking their cocks <laughs> in the bathtubs. Fucking juicy monster cocks with oils. Yeah. You fucking assholes. That. Fucking Susan Wojanski, whatever your fucking name is. <laughs> Why don't you quit fucking clipping your eyebrow lashes and Ooh. fucking get off your ass and do some work? Ooh. What's your favorite? What's your favorite rap battle? Uh, at the epic type. Oh. <laughs> oh. Which is all of them. What would be the best rap battle video, Julian? Uh, Kingdom Hearts versus me. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts versus. Julian! <laughs> is, that how, is that how it goes? Begin! My, my name is Julian. I'm no <laughs> foolian. I like to play <laughs> poolian. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm Kingdom Hearts, and I've, I'm, I've got hope. <laughs> Kingdom Hearts is cool, but you're a dope. A <laughs> <laughs> Rolex is getting in the way. Oh, oh fuck <laughs> you, you <laughs> bastard. <laughs> Uh, you fucking shit. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know what number to put in here. Put in 666, dude. You know it's true. What if it was 1212? I highly doubt it. Okay, go ahead and embarrass yourself. Oh, I have. Oh, I'm sorry. Everyone laugh at Tomar. <laughs> what is Guys, your everybody in real life, I don't care if you're at a family reunion, I don't care where you are. Guys, everyone laugh on three. This is to the audience. One, two, three. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Everybody listening right now, everyone in three. Okay, in in, in a few seconds, we're yep. all gonna jump up in the air at the same time. Everyone in the guys, world is gonna jump at the same guys, time. Guys, I think we're gonna push the planet closer to the sun. Okay, three, two, one. Do you feel that, dude? What I'm that? not superstitious or nothing, but no, it was really no, like 
I think we just had, we experienced zero G for like a second and we fell back to Earth. Did anybody else feel that? I think we knocked Earth off the, the axis, axis of the sun. It was something weird, you guys, but don't joke about it. Like, that was... I'm that's... actually getting the heebie-jeebies. I mean, I can't be the only one. I'm actually getting goose pimples dilating on my arm. <laughs> All I'm right. getting goose pimples the size stop of trying oranges. to sell it if you guys are just gonna do this. <laughs> guys, I'm not kidding. I found the funny house. But where is the funny oh, mouse? I was gonna say- <laughs> I was gonna say that. We've become too predictable. <laughs> <laughs> How do they- that, that, Like, that's not real, right? Mm. The whole- the stereotype of like, oh, if you work at Hooters, you have to have big- Like, cause that- Wouldn't that's, that count that's as- That's pretty real. Wouldn't oh, yeah, that, that count as discrimination? Yeah, but that's the whole point. I know it's a whole point, but like, how does that fly legally? Uh, they just say, uh... They, they say, look at the gazongas on her! <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're right, in the, the contract that says, you have big gazonda, sign here. <laughs> sign. <laughs> sign here, if big booby on you. <laughs> big booby on you! <laughs> there was a very angry woman who sued, because she said, in court, big booby not on me. <laughs> me very angry. Me want. <laughs> Give. Me try work at. It's hoot. probably because people also wouldn't try want, work at. Hoot. People wouldn't want to complain and say like, "Oh, I wanted to work at Hooters." Yeah, it's not. It's no, not. no. So, like, if you could get money out of it, then people would like. Because I mean, Hooters is like considered kind of trashy, can right? Can we role play that? Okay. I'll be the judge and you be the lady trying to work at Hooters. I am a lady. I want <laughs> to have many titty. Uh, welcome to the trial of the century. Give me TT. <laughs> welcome, <laughs> welcome to the trial. <laughs> <laughs> I am Judge Claude Van. Boys and Vooley. girls, ladies and gentlemen, it's the Hooter <laughs> trial with little old lady. The Edge biggest me. trial since OJ Orange Juice. I want him to <laughs> sit down, ma'am. No, you must come to the stand of holy confession Give before. Give me money. <laughs> This is the worst court ever. <laughs> Exhibit A, accurate. my boobie is not big. Okay, ma'am, it says here, you wanted to work at De Hoot. Yeah. <laughs> but your boobie were newt. How do you plead? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> That's the best thing I've ever heard. <laughs> How do you plead? Guilty. <laughs> Come to the stand. State your demand. <laughs> a, a rhyming court. <laughs> the court of rhymes. I, it's like the court of miracles. Yeah. <laughs> it's the cheapest court in America. <laughs> the court of rhymes is? Yeah. yeah. Why would okay. that be the cheapest? It's entertaining. <laughs> I have to keep it up the whole way through. Because no contract it's not, it's, is binding inside the court of rhymes. It's not government funded. That's why there's a <laughs> that's why there's a carnival barker outside with like his cane. Yeah, it's it's jester funded. They have to they have to charge people admission. <laughs> Okay, what, well, uh, she says, uh, she said, Get, take a look at these babies. I say. They, they ain't no, I ain't got no baby. she's boob. holding up her, her grandchildren. Yeah. <laughs> got these babies. <laughs> <laughs> Ma'am, it says on this big piece of A4 paper that your, your case is that you want to work at the hoot, but your breast is newt. Yeah. So, by- by my calculations, you don't have enough breast tissue to work inside this restaurant that yeah, requires so much- I'm here because I want more! Well, this is your lucky day! Give it to me! <laughs> if- if you- if, <laughs> if, if you come up here She opens up her mouth like in Blade. The other- the, the, the defendant hasn't gotten here yet, so if you come up here, I'll- I'll, I'll give you a deal. <laughs> okay. Sign this paper and you'll get one hoot. There it is, the deal's Just on one. screen. <laughs> one hundred million dollars. Dun 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 That's dun, one million dollars. Okay, ma'am, you signed the paper. You- you win, but don't tell the TV yet. It's Whoa. a sign of- sound of signing. Chickity chickity chickity. Chickity chickity. Here's the tissue inside of her breasts. Is it real? Yeah. <laughs> There she is. Is that cancer? That's the old lady in the courtroom. <laughs> they she wants all the money. <laughs> Running towards the judge. <laughs> <laughs> no, because it's got <laughs> speed lines. <laughs> One of the funniest things you can do to your friends is Photoshop their eyes to be slightly yellow. Really <laughs> Why is it the funniest? <laughs> oh, you have jaundice, dude! It's like, hey, I sent you your pictures you wanted. Hey, man, I took these pictures of you at my house. I do, I, I do enjoy fucking with people with Photoshop. <laughs>
Did I tell you about the story where Jaxie convinced like a girl that she had ghosts in her house by like <laughs> really quickly snapping like a screenshot and like dumping it in Photoshop in like a minute? <laughs> And a photoshopping a, a ghost in the background, yeah. Was this person your actual friend? Or no, this was like, like a random person on, like, Justin TV. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah. He's just a complete stranger? Yeah. Uh. She and, like, a couple friends were just, like, just, like, hopped into, like, some random person's stream. It was, like, this girl. She was maybe, like, 18. And... Jaxie's like, I think you got, I think your house is haunted. She's like, what are you talking about? No. She's like, yeah, yeah, I swear. I just saw a ghost behind you. And then sends her this thing that looks like a little, just like a screen cap she just took. <laughs> and it's got this weird, like, silhouette figure like behind her. And she just, she just fucking turns like white on cam. Oh my God. <laughs> There's something to a ghost. That's so fucking mean. <laughs> did she, did you ever clarify, did Jaxie ever clarify that it was not? I don't th think so. There was not only a phantom. <laughs> I don't think she ever did. That's why I honestly hate Jaxie's gut. She's always up to like, no good. She's been photoshopping me in a casket for years and threatening me. <laughs> <laughs> she mailed me a pipe bomb. Luckily, it wasn't activating. Oh, uh, you guys. Up. That's all just her joking around. That's her way of saying she likes you. She threw a grenade at me, but luckily the handkerchief it was wrapped up inside of prevented it from going off. <laughs> See? Uh, she didn't want to kill anybody. My, my, my. Aren't you a child? <laughs> Yes, I am we this are child. All children. <laughs> We're all children here. Talk to Goomby. <laughs> oh my, 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 I'm too much child. <laughs> <laughs> there, there, should be, <laughs> there should be a ROM hack that every single character says that. <laughs> what is that with funny? That, with that true. <laughs> <laughs> Would that not drive you insane <laughs> if you played a game and everybody said that to you? <laughs> they had normal dialogue for like the first half and then they just turned into that. Why don't you laugh at anything, ding dong? I don't know. <laughs> laugh at this. <laughs> nah, that's okay. <laughs> play, the, play the xylophone. Give it a go. Oh yeah. Be our musical we, accompaniment. We, we got a big surprise today, ladies and gentlemen. Play us a, play us a Kickstarter music. <laughs> No. Wait, wait, I got a guitar. I'll play it. You, you play the game. Wait, no. How do you play this? Julian, you gotta do the Kickstarter. Julian. Oh, I don't know how to do. Julian. What? You gotta do the Kickstarter yeah. narration. Oh, okay. Well, this is gonna be really hard. So I go. Wait. Wait, no, it goes. <laughs> Hi, we're the Barry Brothers, and we have invented. <laughs> 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 Come on. Oh, Come I, on. Oh, I can do it. I can do it. I just need to. Okay, wait, wait. I can't play guitar, by the way. Again. It's too real. <laughs> oh, go. Ow, my finger. My finger. Hi, I'm Ronald McFour Ronald. <laughs> 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 I'm so sorry. Just, just hit whatever I'm notes really, you want. Okay. I'm really bad any, at any notes. I'm really yeah, bad notes. at keeping a straight face. I'm gonna sell you the best night of your life. Take, take my wife, please. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do the narration. That's a good yeah, narration. I'm sorry, Chris. I'm what? not. Here's my narration. Okay, you ready? To Why am I yeah. doing this? Hello, I'm a boy, and I like playing with my toy. <laughs> If you, if you want to buy my toy, I'll fucking kill you. This is stupid. I never want to do this. What an awful idea. What do you mean? It was great. Uh, Give me back the controller. Give me back the controller. I'm gonna pass out. Help! Everyone, please donate to the Kickstarter. Oh no. <laughs> Come here. Stop. I'm hitting trying you. to. I'm trying to pat your back. Julian's hitting me. I'm trying to pat your back. He's striking me. Quit <laughs> moving around. Oh, Help. I missed two. No, Julian, leave him alone. I'm trying to save him. Did Wait. I tell that story that I didn't like McDonald's as a kid? I didn't like Ronald McDonald because I thought he got his clown makeup and all the food, his greasy clown makeup. <laughs> 
What if? Uh, what if I thought he prepared the food, so he <laughs> he would go in the kitchen because he's sweating back there. His his greasy makeup okay. would be getting in all of it. Okay, Julian. Yeah. What if you were at McDonald's and there was a Ronald McDonald just like guy in a suit walking around entertaining kids, uh -huh. and then uh, when a kid was looking so it's away, back at me. No, no, no. This is a new scenario. Oh. So you're sitting. You're enjoying a delicious McDonald's burger, right? Oh. You look over. This kid's like, ha <laughs> ha, waving at you, and you're like, oh. You wave back, right? Yeah. You get back to your burger and you look up and Ronald McDonald is behind the kid, right? Yeah. And he's like, he's doing all goofy shit and making the kid laugh, right? Okay. And you're like, oh, this, this is nice. And then the kid looks away, right? Look, looks out at the window at a bird. Ronald McDonald stares you in the eye and he grabs his nose. He sprays pus into the kid's oh, no. burger. Pus from his nose? <laughs> just, just, just disgusting pus. And he smiles. And then he puts the top back on the burger and the kid looks around and he's about to eat it. What would you do? I hate this. I hate this so much. That must be that's one of the most disgusting visuals I can think of. Is if if a if a clown nose was actually just swollen from pus. <laughs> like he squeezes it and it's not red anymore because he drained it out. Julian, what would you do? Uh, I'd probably... Julian, just, what, 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 okay. Is the kid by himself or are his parents there? This will help. What if his nose then popped off his face and it bounced on the floor like a normal ping pong ball? What? What the hell? <laughs> yeah, what does that imply? That implies you're going crazy. Okay, uh, I would jump on the ceiling and do a... <laughs> Tiptoe dance. Okay, so okay, now never mind that. His his nose is still full of pus. Okay. His pus. <laughs> pus. His nose. So much pussy. <laughs> Julian, come on. What would you do? I'd probably I'd probably say don't eat that, and I'd show him the burger. But then there would be it would be magically clean again. Exactly. And I would look like a crazy man. Yeah. And then you go to jail for hitting on a Ronald kid. Would... <laughs> hitting on a kid. <laughs> Ronald will say, "What are you looking for? Pus? What are you looking for? A pussy?" And he shoves me. <laughs> and then he lifts the bun again, and there's a vagina on top of the. Oh my god! I, that, no, that would be horrifying. Julian, what would you do if uh, he lifted up the burger bun when the kid's looking away again, and, and there was a big was floppy dick just like swinging around, and he puts the thing back down, and I it's... would take it home with me. You'd steal the kid's burger. Yeah, it had a dick in it. <laughs> what if you got home and you and you pulled open the burger bun again, and the dick's not there, but instead a big pussy vagina. It's Ronald's oh face, god. and he winks at you. <laughs> what would you do if uh, you woke up in prison from uh, talking to the kid and Ronald McDonald sprayed pus on the bars and broke you out? Uh, I would I would go stay at his weird crack house. <laughs> would you trust him now? Yeah. Okay. Because <laughs> clearly, he, clearly he orchestrated the whole thing to get to me. Yeah. Like this, this is all a plan to get me back to his apartment for some reason. Okay, and then he brings you back to his apartment, and that now a bunch of other clowns there. Is it like a clown resistance that they're trying to recruit? He me begins into? his process of mitosis and splits into many more Ronald McDonalds. Uh -huh. and then they make a big chain, and they block you from leaving. Do they turn into a giant ball? <laughs> <laughs> a big start ball of clowns and start rolling around, shooting at you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no one's gonna understand that. Have we talked about this before. We yeah, talked we about it. It's Enderon, okay. but um, Julian. <laughs> Yeah. What if the only way out was through Ronald McDonald's own the cavity? Like his body? Yeah. I would go. <laughs> I would love to go inside a clown's body. It's probably really goofy in there. It's full of pus. There wouldn't be like balloons or nothing? No, it's just it'd clown just pus. be really disgusting. Oh. That would be disappointing. There's french fry rem remnants in there. I'd probably still do it. Really... I would do like a fantastic journey sort of thing. <laughs> I bought my Pokemon. There, where's there's... the girl? Where's the girl who talks about having something on your shoulder? The blood whistle or whatever. <laughs> Whoa! Ah! Why is there a white hand on your shoulder? Because uh, somebody came. I bought Pokemon <laughs> in a car boot sale, and it was covered in battery acid. And we it don't stretched. have car boot sales here in America. <laughs> what the fuck is a car boot sale? It made sale? my sprites look jumbled up. What's a car boot sale? I bought a Pokemon executable file at the garage sale, and when I put it in my PC Macintosh, <laughs> I got I a virus. And Pikachu came on the screen, but his eyes were oddly realistic and blood. Was and blood. Out. Okay, let's go. I Which, bought a Pokemon with, card and it made my a, screen turn brown. Needless to say, the beast was stunned. I, I, don't, I, don't re <laughs> I, I don't remember it looking that way, but I kept playing on. And then I turned on the TV and there was SpongeBob, but it wasn't Squid. It, was, it wasn't exactly Squidward. Was all upset. I, I dropped my Game Boy in my toilet and I flushed it, and then my Pikachu was dead. I tried to drive for the ocean because I wanted to meet SpongeBob, but I never met him. Gyarados, look at and he's screaming me, and I kill him with an. 
I'm mm, bored. Yeah, me too. Can we do a situation where I am Misty, Ding Dong is Brock, uh -huh. Julian's Ash, but I am Misty with Ash, and we are going into the Pewter City Gym for the first time. I've never been to the Pewter City Gym before. I Ash, hope that you need to my find Pokemon Brock. are the right type <laughs> as to have a type advantage. You broke her bike. Uh, you broke her bike. You broke her bike. You broke her bike. You broke her bike. Gym leader bike. of this gym. Oh, I'm so wet because I'm the water. Po Trainer. I get it. That's, <laughs> a, that's a good Pokemon joke. I'm coming with you guys. Thanks for doing Pokemon jokes for I'm Ron my Hart. benefit. Do you get it? Are we friends now? Is this how you date? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for doing Pokemon jokes for me. <laughs> <laughs> what I you know you that? know that Pokemon means a lot to me, Misty, so I appreciate it. <laughs> You making a joke just for my Pokemon benefit. Pokemon humor is my only kind of humor. <laughs> I don't understand any other joke. What about puns? Okay, that's pretty cool. I got hard like Metapod. <laughs> okay, we're not going to make puns anymore. <laughs> Well, wow, Metapod kind of looks like a penis. Stop Have you it. ever thought There's about two it? Of us, two I can go back. Kitchens. We're still in pewter. I can turn around. <laughs> two ashes, one miss, one bra. One family. I, why, are there, why are there two ashes? What did I sign up for? Trust why am I here? Let's I don't know you. I can't trust you. They would have said that on the show. <laughs> I'm putting out a. I'm putting out a request to our audience. Everybody, I'm putting a hit out. <laughs> Everybody if draw, anybody in the audience wants to take it up, draw Leon Kennedy as a My Little Pony because he's always clip clopping. There's already like millions of those <laughs> for sure. Listen to him. Listen to his clip clops. Draw Leon Kennedy, but draw the front of his hair. Draw his bangs. What like, are you 20 doing? Times longer. Draw Leon S. Kennedy, but his larms are all bendy. His larms. <laughs> his larms. Draw, uh, draw Leon's bangs extending all the way to his feet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a funny visual. I just, I just thought about it. <laughs> He's stepping on him. He says, "Oh, see, says stepping on my bangs." Do 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> Ding dong shook his head really disapprovingly. Oh, Julie. Tor, what would you do if uh, Jaxi uh, smiled like a DreamWorks character and then never stopped doing it? Like she permanently like had her face. She just always had like a smirk with an eyebrow up. Yeah, but she got like plastic surgery to always look like that. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> and then she got plastic surgery to have the body of a bee from B movie. And then she had uh. the plastic surgery to get the, the head from the fish head from Will Smith from that movie, <laughs> Tim Shark Tale. <laughs> Shark Tale. Yeah. <laughs> and she also had plastic surgery to have the ears of Shrek. And she, the, the heads of salad fingers. She drew all so over not the dream fucking words. wall. <laughs> But I'll let it slide. There's the record player. Okay, and the so, feet so of Donkey. He's got, the, he's got the hands of Stuart Little. The okay, hands of Stuart Little. not DreamWorks Is he either. a DreamWorks? Is, is Stuart Little not DreamWorks? Is it? I don't know. I don't, might I don't, not be. I don't he's know not who did Stuart Litter, but I don't... Little, did, but... Did you know Stuart Litter uh, was written by M. Night Shyamalan? I know, I knew that. That's not being funny. That's real, by yeah. the way. You're dead that was, serious. That's yeah. dead serious. And that was also after The Sixth Sense. Yeah. Put that in your pipe and smoke it, Tomer. I did not know that. And that's pretty. That's pretty nice music. Tomar has a secret YouTube channel where he smokes a big Gandalf pipe and debunks Christianity. <laughs> I've seen it before. Oh, it's a different room. That's a real uh, living Tomer. being. She go rip her leg off. Honestly, would just love to run up behind her with a piano wire and just fucking. <laughs> this isn't gonna be good. What is wrong, my daughter? I love you. Thank you. Can I buy this one? She's got the face. Okay, that one wasn't that. Hell, bad. she's a d -d 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 demon. She's a d -d 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 bitch. <laughs> there, I got the crown. That was the last thing I needed to put in that pot. Oh, oh! Someone turned your house oh. into a slum. Oh, there's a live oh. someone, someone put slime in your house. Someone put the eyeballs looking everywhere. <laughs> uh oh. Someone put RGB red on everything. RGB red. <laughs> You mean just R? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking specifically remember that I used to hate Thomas the Tank Engine. And, uh, like, even as a kid, I was like, this is the most boring shit I've ever seen in my life. And then, uh, I, I just used to watch it because there was literally nothing else on. And my mom and dad saw me watching it, so they got me a bunch of Thomas the Tank oh Engine Oh my god. Oh. I was like, oh. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Chris. Thank you. There's even, there's a video of me lying. They got me a Thomas the Tank Engine, uh, Jigsaw puzzle, and I said, 
This is just what I've always wanted. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's a, adorable. That was very nice of you to lie for them. That was a great little liar. It turns out your parents really love Thomas the Tank Engine. They wanted <laughs> My to dad wanted to play with it. <laughs> yeah, they were doing it on purpose because they knew you wouldn't use it. My dad got plastic surgery to have his face look like uh, Henry from Thomas the Tank Engine. It like sticks out of his head and is gray now. <laughs> Does he still have the same voice? They didn't have voices. They were voiced by Ringo Stingo. Ringo Stingo? I guess yeah. that's true, weren't they? Uh, it was like, all, it was all narrated by the, yeah. And then Thomas came down and he fucking fell over. <laughs> <laughs> he fucking fell over. The snow falls. The, the wind calls. <laughs> Santa screams across the hill and then he falls. <laughs> <laughs> you can't ride falls with falls. Put the present <laughs> under the tree. Everybody's going to squee. Everybody run inside and sing along. Tonight. Christmas! <laughs> Welcome home! Daddy brought home... something <laughs> warm. A Toblerone. <laughs> a Toblerone. <laughs> Daddy brought home a Toblerone. Mommy cooks it inside the heat. And then we eat our sweets. <laughs> you could have just edited that out of eat. You didn't have to say eat our sweets. <laughs> Doesn't work. <laughs> the, the stocking above the fire. Santa walks in with his pyre. What? He, he walks on the poor wire and kicks us across the floor. <laughs> Daddy sleeps so loud he snores. Crystallizes in the, his wars. <laughs> My favorite fetish has to be war. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas, every whore! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> 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 <laughs>